This is how my day is going so far. It's all cleaned up on the floor though. Thanks to a little helper, thank you. I'm working on a new painting for my painting class. I, I don't know, it's, I've worked on it so far for a couple days, maybe two days and I feel like it took um, a long time in that kind of awkward like, oh wow, I don't have faith in any of my um, abilities and like everything I've painted before that I've liked has ever been, you know, it's, it's been luck. And I feel like I go through this a lot and I know other artists do as well sometimes. Um, it's not so much that we lose confidence, we're just kind of like, hmm, okay, well, um, maybe I got lucky the rest of the times. But yeah, I feel like right now it's kind of in a place that I'm okay with it for what it is. Um, considering that it's not a model that I would have picked. It's not a pose that I would have picked. I wouldn't have put her in the most boring outfit I possibly could have with no colors in it and my professor brought in this like awful looking dead plant and put it in front of her and it looks like she's on some kind of safari and I just I'm not a fan of it. grocery shopping on Thanksgiving or like Christmas Eve or something. Like, you won't make it out alive. It's actually cleared out a little bit now, but when I first got here, there was like a million people. Um, you know, I had to wait on the line. And like, people just walk up and we're like cutting everyone on the line and like, no one says anything. And I'm like, what, like, you wanna wait here longer? Like, you wanna, you wanna just hang out here all day? That's fine, but I don't really wanna do that. Just hang out here for um, a couple minutes while I, drink my, I, I don't actually know if this is a regional drink, but I got like some kind of pine nut, white chocolate something, mocha, I don't remember, I forget. I have to go and like break five quad because I don't have two single quad to like ride the bus back, I forgot. So I have to remember to do that. So try and remind me, <laughs> I, have to, I have to bring singles with me. I keep forgetting. This happened last time. This happened yesterday when I came out too. that I had all my groceries in. Let me open my stuff, I wanna see what's in it. I think most of it, actually pretty much all of it probably, is gonna be Christmas decorations. I just carried all this up in the rain and now I'm like sweating. 
I didn't buy presents for babies this time. I didn't buy you guys presents, I'm sorry. My scissors. Actually, I know what this one is. I think this is Christmas garland. Cause I saw like green poking out of one of the corners. Yep, Christmas garlands. I'm not gonna leave them like this because it's like tacky, but for like the past year plus, I've been collecting um, pine cones outside and I bought some red like Christmas balls and I'm gonna put some fake snow. So I'm gonna make them look nice and I'm gonna hang them probably in the living room somewhere. I mean, depending on how much room. Honestly, I like bought a bunch of stuff in a frenzy and I don't exactly remember what I got, but this definitely is a real. Cute. Then this one actually, I don't know what this one is. Yay. So these are gonna go on the garlands. I'm pretty sure these are socks. Look at these socks. Because I have shoes that are like, oh, sorry, honey. I have, I just beamed it right on the head, I'm sorry. I have shoes that you can see the sock except for the front part and I tried wearing them without socks and I got such awful blisters because they're a little bit too small. Let's see how ridiculous these look. Excuse me, I'm busy. I'm showing people my new socks. <laughs> Okay, I am done figuratively and literally. So, got all these laying around. I also decided to, um, you know, just paint some pine cones that I had um, kind of out for decoration. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but I put some glitter on them too. So, yeah, you can see a little bit of it. Crafters, we just always have paint and glitter on everything. I'm so exhausted. I think I'm like coming down with a cold. Can you get off me please? And you can you can get off the table now, please. Um, yeah, I think I'm coming down with a cold. Um, so that's fun. But I wanna show you guys, I recently actually, this new place opened up. This smells, <laughs> that like burns the inside of my nose. It's so spicy. They're like, oh, you're not afraid of spicy food? I'm like, well, I'm not gonna eat your sauce or whatever. Even my Chinese friends are like, oh, this is so spicy, it's, it's kind of gross, and then they didn't eat it, so I didn't feel bad like the first time I went. I always order this, which I know probably doesn't really <laughs> look like much, but um, it's swanton pai gu. It looks really spicy, but it's actually, I think, a tomato base, and that's why it's that color. Everyone always gets like swanton yu, and like that restaurant never seems to have it, so I always get the pai gu. So tonight, I think, um, even though I'm not feeling super duper well, I think I'm gonna go to the gym with Connie. Yeah, if I go, I'll take you with me so you can kind of see the state of my school's gym. I mean, it gets the job done. It has like what I need, you know, to use. So it's fine. <laughs> but, um, you know, it might be a little bit different from what a lot of you guys are used to seeing. So that might be fun. This is bomb. This is so good. You can't have any though. No, it's not for babies. Mm -hmm. 